Hey guys, this is Nick, the NDC Chief here, and I'm going to unbox and do a quick first impressions of the Tenka Bullseye Noise Cancelling Earbuds. Brand new to the market, so you can expect that I'm going to be comparing them to a couple different headsets, including the Tenka Remixed Wireless Headphones, as well as Apple's EarPods. This is the NDC Chief, so fire up that intro and let's get started. Inside, you are greeted with a little bit of packaging and some information about Tenka as a company and some of the stuff that they do, which I already said they usually dabble in Bluetooth accessories, which is why it's kind of cool, as I said, to see a wired headset. You get this cool Tenka carrying case, which Tenka branded on one side, nothing on the other. If you cut open on into it, you open up with only one zipper. You see on top, you have your size different uh, ear heads, ear heads? We'll call them those. You have large and small in the baggie and actually on the earbuds themselves. It's the average or medium size. So if we open up this little package here, here are the actual Tenka Bullseyes. Bear in mind, this is a $20 price point and for $20 you get quite a bevy of features. Starting off with the cable itself, it is a flat tingle free cable, which is always cool to see. It has a remote and microphone, works with both Android and iOS, and the earbuds themselves are aluminum. Tenka really knocked it out of the park here for only $20. For $20, you get your earbuds, mine are in black, but it also comes in red, white, green, or blue. Kind of some off the wall colors there. I chose the black ones because I'm traditional, you know, I don't want to be standing out in the crowd, I want my nice black headphones. They have 11 millimeter drivers, which is pretty large for earbuds. They have aluminum builds, which makes them nice and durable. As you can definitely tell when you're holding them, they got a little bit of heft to them, but they're light enough to the point where they're not like hurting your ears or anything. The microphone, for me, worked without any issues. You know, you have your classic one button pause, two button forward, three button back. The microphone for $20, like I said, it's a $20 head headset. The microphone is actually fairly clear. I did a couple test calls with it. They, people that I called so that they weren't having any problems hearing me or anything. And when it was in a louder situation, they did say, I, I didn't get drowned out per se, but you could definitely hear it. It's not as noise cancellation as the headphones themselves. The noise cancellation for a $20 headset is ridiculous. The noise cancellation in terms of almost any headset is great. You can barely hear anything if you not, if you not if not nothing in terms of outside noise. Something that always seems to be the Achilles heel of headsets for me is noise bleeding. Now it's not like I listen to like Britney Spears and things or like stuff I would be embarrassed to be caught listening to and I worry that oh god they're gonna hear what I'm listening to and they're gonna make fun of me and judge me. Yeah, no. I just think it's kind of obnoxious if I'm sitting next to someone and you know they're respectful enough to have their headphones in but there's this sound bleeding that just makes it like the headphones aren't even there. I had a couple people test this out with me, and even at an extremely high volume, they said there was zero sound leakage, which is something that I, you know, you can't like find it on a website, you know, it's not something they advertise, you know, zero sound leakage, but it's something that I found with these, and it's something that is awesome for me. They fit really well in my ears, which is the traditional medium sized one, and they don't budge, they go right in, simple as that and they don't move they're in and they're in you know I could jog I could sit I could do whatever I want and they're in and they're good to go which is always a cool feature to have the gold plated uh, adapter simple three and a half millimeters you know straight up no uh, curve to it or anything like that so it'll go into most devices and like I said that remote works on both Android and iOS Bottom line, you don't watch a video like this for an unboxing of headphones. You don't watch it necessarily for my intentions. You watch it for if I would recommend these headsets to you. Answer, yes. If you were looking for a pair of earbuds. If you're looking for an over-the-ear headset, look somewhere else. But if you're in the market for earbuds, earbuds in my mind shouldn't be anywhere over $60, I say is a fair amount. Because, you know, they're earbuds. But at a $20 price point, these produce incredibly clear audio, 
great bass and they fit well, they stay well in your ears, they're durable enough to the point because they're aluminum, they're not going to really damage anything, they're not going to damage themselves, they're not going to get scratched. They come in cool colors, which is something I like to see, I mean, I'm not going to buy into the cool colors, but I like to see those options if they're available for people. I would highly recommend this if you were looking at all into earbuds. They're $20, they're shipped for free if you choose to do so. I made sure I got the delivery confirmation just in case there were any problems. It was like $1.44 or something. But free shipping, quick shipping. I got it before the date I was supposed to. They come from Pennsylvania, in case you want to base that if you like live in California or whatever. They're, they're out of Pennsylvania and you get them in fairly decent time, about three to five business days unless you pay for expedited shipping, which of course, you know, it gets quicker and quicker as the price goes further up but sound quality stellar just I enjoyed this really really well this was a great experience for me I played around with these for about a week I think today sixth day I think but I listened to them in my room alone you know that was fine and a crowded bus all different scenarios all different types of music and they were really really good um of course, if the sound quality of your music isn't like really good, then they're not going to sound great. Like if you just rip music off of YouTube, it's not going to sound very good. But if you have legitimate purchased music at like good bit rates and everything, then it's going to sound great. These headphones for $20 are a steal. I'm going to drop the link down in the description for you guys to go over to the Tenka website. $20 straight up. Go buy them if you are in the market. Anyway, guys, this is the NDC Chief and look forward to some more coverage with the Tenka Bullseyes. In a future video, I'm going to be comparing them directly to my Apple EarPods, which I cannot find at the moment. Just kidding. Here they sit in a beautiful tangled mess. Doesn't happen with the bullseyes with the tangle free key keyboard. Yes, tangle free keyboard. No, the tangle free wire. I can jangle these up however I so desire, and it just stays beautiful with the nice flat rubber cable which is always something I like to see. Now the interesting thing though, this comparison, $30, $20. We'll see how that influences how they sound, the way they work, everything like that, specs and whatever else I wanna talk about in an upcoming video. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Anyway guys, this is the NEC Chief, so like it down below and subscribe if you have not for some more great tech content, whether it be headphones for your music, for your Xbox, whatever it may be, mobile, I'm into Android, I'm all over the place for all kinds of great tech videos for you guys. If I find something interesting, I make sure that you guys are the first to know about it. And if you don't know, I'm on Twitter, at the NDC Chief, same way it is spelled in my YouTube username, and as well as I have a blog, which I'm getting more into as the weeks go on. I will drop a link for that in the description as well. So, this was my quick unboxing and uh, first impressions of the Tank of Bullseyes. Make sure you guys have an awesome day. See you guys later.